it's been six months since I've done a video since I got the box it's literally been six months and so things have changed and they're gonna continue to change like always but we're gonna start on this top my little top box that I have on top of my epic it's not a Mac it's a husky I have to have a speaker flip five snap on wipes amazing little harbor freight screws come in so fucking handy anything i need i constantly constantly refilling them john wick take care of my box it'll snap on top box bottom chest that i use for chargers and stuff like that and what is in there oh cool see like blades perfect little obs little c10s t handles Plug for my light red sandpaper drawer for cutting and buffing leftover blades if you know you know fine line trim tools magnet My planner from last year. Knives. Can't have enough knives. Ever. Sharpies. Go through Sharpies so much. Pens. Pencils. Anything I need. Miscellaneous personal stuff. Mostly Prilosect. Band-Aids. Spoons. Air fresheners for bathroom trips. Flashlights. Flashlights are a must in an auto body industry. Constantly taking things apart, can't see shit. Obviously, gotta need that. Thermostat. Check some random stuff, mostly my cap temperature. <laughs> snack drawer. Well, snack bit, whatever. Wire loom. More miscellaneous nuts, set screws, rivets washers zip ties fuses self tappers name it i have it going down to my epic 68 these are a must in any socket trace keeps them from rusting must these are pittsburgh i believe yeah, Pittsburgh. They weren't so great. They, I could tell the difference. Mac Deep 3.8s. Mac Shallows 3.8s. Came free with a set of impacts that I bought a couple years back. Adapters. Impact. Non-impact. Magnetic 10. A 10 for wheels. For three-piece wheels. I've done quite a bit of those. 3.8s 10s. Quarter tens from Durlast, I think. Yeah, they're Durlast. Yeah, Durlast. All this whole row right there. They were all right. I needed some half inch. I went with the icon ones. Didn't realize they were going to be missing 20, 23, 24. So, yeah, I might go with the Tekton set and take these home or use it for another box at home. These are Silver Eagle metric. Oh no, they're standard. I say these are metric. These are metric. These are metric. These are metric. These are SAE. SAE shallows, also Silver Eagle. Metric deeps, 3 8 3 8 3 8 shallows, Silver Eagles. These are expert metric. Deeps, shallows, some more adapters that I know where to put. I should just put them over here. No, I'll leave them there. I should put this one over here, though. And this one. Icon. Bit set. Amazing. Thing works good. I liked it. I was just very happy with that, even though it's Icon. Another Harbor Freight tool that came in really handy. You never know when you need it, and I needed it to take off the alternator bracket. 
came out perfect. 100th edition, 100th anniversary snap-on quarter inch. Three-eighths swivel, swivel head. Can't have, can't, can't be in this industry and not have that icon ratchet. Had it for about two years now. Long reach, quarter inch. Flex head, use this a lot for bumpers. Even though it's a quarter, I loosen it up with the breaker bar or something and then I take it out with that, perfect. Mac, I've had this for years, quarter inch. It's kind of, maybe grease it up maybe. Silver Eagle quarter inch, recently rebuilt this one. Another Silver Eagle eighth inch, I mean three eighths, what am I saying? And a Cobalt three eighths, though I've had it since I was like 16. And an Expert one that came with that set, three eighths. Can't be in this industry without having medicine. Hex bits, adapters. This roller goes on a pry bar. It rolls out dents. Use it a lot. Left over, well not left over. Spare keys. I've been looking for this charger. Playing cards. Can't, can't, I always have playing cards. Extensions. Half inch to three eighths long extensions. Bottle opener. Reach mirror. Of course, I have to have to have that. Silver Eagle Torx. I use them a lot. The warranty sucks. Same with these icons. They don't want me to return one. They want me to return the whole set. It's kind of stupid. So I went ahead and got the Max set. Stubbies, so much better. Mac bits for removing strip but bolts. Love them. Triple squares. Audis, BMWs, you know. Flashlight. Oh. Long reach hex. Silver Eagle set, master set. Got it like six years ago. Use the hell out of it. Little old sets that I've had with Walmart rails. That's enough with top drawer. Don't have much wrenches, but I you do use them. I don't need to have a lot. Because I only have what I use. I only have one swivel seven for anything GM. Perfect. It's the only reason I only got one. I only need that one. Another bottle opener. Don't know why I have that. So I have SAE and metric. Ratcheting, ratcheting. Non ratchet, non ratchet. Metric set that I use when I need to go somewhere to do a side job on the side really quick. Perfect. I have metric and SAE. Pittsburgh pri breaker bar, amazing. Amazing. For the price, it's amazing. Same thing with this long reach pry bar. Amazing for the price. Snap on hose picks. I use them for hoses, but I also use them to open handles and stuff like that. Love it. Same thing with these. I don't need to buy a snap on everything. I also have torque wrenches from Pittsburgh, half inch, three eighths. They work perfect. Don't know why I bought this, to be honest. Scrapers, smack, super sharp. Love them. It's doing door skins, perfect. Adapter, 90 degree adapter. Love it. Gotta have one of these. Icon nut drivers, also amazing. Snap on mini mini picks, mini screwdrivers, mini torques. Use the hell out of those. I really do. I only bought one. I did not have to buy the whole set. This is perfect long reach for Mercedes door handles. They have the set screw in the middle of the door. So this long reach non-coning tip is perfect for that. Long reach max screwdrivers, door panel remover poppers. These are just pretty. Snap on the master set. Well, not master set, but I like the color. That's second drawer. Screwdrivers and wrenches. Specialty tools. Brake pad presses, spring compressor set, bearing press, rear axle bearing puller set. 
that's not a snap on. <laughs> Level. Uh, Harbor Freight tap and die. It works for what I do. It's perfect. These are axle nuts from Mac. It's the three set. I paid more for this set than the o OEM master set from AutoZone, which works perfect because it has to be 12 point Mercedes, BMWs. But I have them. It's all right. Lug nut sockets from Mac. Use the hell out of those. Impact screwdriver. Release those stubborn rotor nuts. Punches. Digital caliber. Miniature grinder. Cut off wheel. Whatever you want to use it as. Brake bleeder. I've used it once. Rivets set for Mopar for the plastic rivets. It's good for what it is for Harbor Freight. Ten bucks. Plastic door handles, removals for the clip for the window cranks. Hand punch. And also flange. It creates a flange. It's pretty cool. Mac. Set suit screw inserter. Hand rivet gun. Oil change wrenches. Large rivet gun. Brake release tools. Fuel line bender. One of my favorite drawers. Clips, any kind of clip you need, any kind of rivet you need, anything electrical you need. Use the hell out of this drawer. Bags for organization. Organization is key, obviously. More electrical things, I don't know why that's not over there. Duct tape. You never know when you need red duct tape or blue. Or white. Tips for glue. Bunch of one eighth bit drill bits. Don't want to buy a bunch of snap on ones, which I do have master set of snap on in Mac shorts. Great for like wheel, uh, you know, door jams when I can't get to a hinge or something. These are from Spider, I believe. Pliers. Files for bodywork. Don't know what that is. Garbage. Blades. Punches from Harbor Freight. Really good punches, actually. Can't complain. My personal stuff that I just write down for the day, what I my hours, what I have planned for the week, and. This here is my collection of Mac Tools Limited, which is the short, I don't even know what those are, standard or metric, I have those, I have the screwdrivers, I have the longer wrenches I have the zero degrees ratchets three eighths and quarter tap and die yes a tap it a gold plated tap and die chisels yes gold plated chisels a John Force wrench collaboration set line wrenches extensions locking extensions actually pretty cool stubby wrenches and some needle nose very proud of owning this set still a couple that i'm looking for no rush for that when they come they come welding stuff gotta have for tig for mig Heat gun, chargers, every kind of chargers. Oh, my stomach hurts. Yes. 
zip ties in there, a bunch of zip ties. Let's go with this one. My mini buffer set. Amazing little set that I got at Hobby Lobby, I think. My apron for buffing. Lumalite. If you're a painter and you do not have a Lumalite, yeah, you need it ASAP. It goes with my WS400. I use it today for painting my own car with my Intec and my Supernova WS400. These are really good guns too. Snap on belt sander. When you can't get to a compressor, this is perfect. Gloves, more bags. Stress reliever. My power tool drawer without power, but they're power tools. 3.8 impact by Dewalt. Amazing power in that little thing. Half inch impact snap on. Obviously, amazing power in that. Milwaukee rivet gun. You need that if you don't have one. These are trash. These I like because they're super small. Even though I have this one, but it's a lot bigger. My snap on driver. I love that thing. It's super compact. And it's, I have my, mag the, whoa, that was a fail. And I have it make the magnet on it, which I love. Mini buffer from Mac. And I have the mini buffer, if I can't get it out, but I have the mini buffer from Milwaukee. Rayobi Grill garbage. This is an amazing pack driver. This one sucks. Okay, so that was my 68 and my top box. And this is my fridge. Ew. Soda. Soda. Cholula. Cheese. Lime. Okay, now to my cart that I push around the shop when I don't want well, when I don't have on me what's in my big box, I do have it in here. I do have a light under there, powered by another light. Magnet. That was craftsman. I love it. My bit set, my bit adapters for my bit drivers. Your wall, 20 volt. Got it for like 100 bucks, so it works. I love this thing. Use it a lot. Another thing with Icon that if one breaks, they want the whole set back. I'll probably do that today. Ratcheting screwdriver, snap on, use it a lot. Non handle breaker bars. Handle breaker bars, they're really good. Besides that, the striker cap does not make contact with the pry bar itself. I had to learn that the hard way. More air pressure. Long reach icon swivel. Use it a lot. Except the T20 keeps falling out. Magnet. Craftsman quarter inch. Snap on swivel locking head quarter inch. Zero degree tiny, tiny quarter inch. Need to oil it. Titan swivel head. Use it a lot. No bit driver from Craftsman. Blowgun. Harbor Freight. Mac pry bar, no handle. Mac nut ratchets. I mean. Crap, I forgot. 
these are from the local swap meet they sucked obviously they break pay like six bucks for them craftsman short shallows metric nsae snap on mids all metric mac deeps 12 point metric and snap on tens these these were garbage these are from tractor supply they did not work i did not like them for shit these are all mac these nuts nut driver bit adapters mac coast lug lug nut sockets most used 17 19 21 use them a lot amazon extensions use them a lot lost one of them already don't know where it's at expert impacts that's my cat stewie Ex expert shallows metric standard metric standard deep another flashlight another knife bags of the car that I'm working on right now pocket pry bars don't have them we need them they work so much better than these screwdrivers so much better more pens use them a lot batteries use them a lot Mac screwdrivers with the original handle I love these handles I like these better than these these seem to like bite better too clip removers for the smaller headed ones and these are perfect for like the door jam really tight ones against the edge don't without breaking them this one takes it off perfectly belt molding removal removal tool use that one a lot i really don't use this one but i do use this one for like the hood insulation clips use this one because it's a lot stronger than this one same with this one it's the same one but long combination of dewalt and craftsman bits drill bits i don't want to walk all the way up my big box when i have a cart out in the shop i just use those this one is soft close love that receipt these are blades i believe yeah they're blades gear wrench metric use those a lot it's these standard ones i used to use them a lot not so much anymore i haven't been working on classic cars in a while pliers gotta have all these these were actually garbage i did not like them mac very disappointing from these this set they were they weren't very good i might get a set from snap on and put these on off it they rust they it's the same set as in the big box I don't like them. They fall apart. They rust really bad. These I use a lot. I don't know why they're not in my electrical drawer. Same thing with these. These are good. I like them. Clip remover for Mac. Great tool. I know Snap. I know Harbor Freight has one too. But that one blew up on me. So I bought this one. Cookies. Safety glasses, adjustables from Mac. I got them from Mac, but I don't believe, I think they're really old to something else. I grinded this one down to make it bigger because I needed it to take off a drive line. That wasn't supposed to close like that. Vice grip drawer. Most of them are Mac, but I also have some Bremen in here that have been amazing. Um, I, some of them even lock better than my Mac ones. Not Like really, there's a lot of Bremen in here. These are all my blocks. I use a lot of acrylic. These my body work a lot straighter than these. Well, I, I'll use these for smaller stuff for little quick insurance work. These for high-end work. A body line tool that I invented. This is my design. I had it cut out 
with aluminum stock. I started it with wood, but this is my design. I should patent it ASAP before some dumbass takes it from me. My air tools, grinders, I use every single one of these for its own purpose. I have no idea why I have that one on there, sorry. But yes, I do have one for each size that I use for burbits, use burbits a lot, especially in the body, body work industry. I haven't used this one in a while since I got that one. But it's a great, great ratchet, super compact. Two pound slide hammer, use it for door jams, perfect. All the wrenches for these. I have the air punch also. It also makes flanges, but it's air. It's from Harbor Freight. Great, great tool. Seam Buster. Great tool. Use it a lot for doing skins. Sawzall from Blue Point. Great tool. When I'm doing quarter panels, this is a great one. Doing door skins. I mean, uh, Quarter, quarter panels and bed skins. This was a perfect one to weld. Use first DA I ever bought back in 2009, I believe. I have another one that I use for polishing in here. The newer design, which is just a diff difference is a black cap. So back to this, I use these rods for welding on edges of jams when I'm doing gapping on classic cars been working great got it off of an idea off of my my buddy brandon years back putting together obviously for welding I'm using it in a while hammer drawer harbor freight harbor freight harbor freight matco matco uh i believe these are from a1 they were all right i was kind of disappointed and my snap-on one, my snap-on hammer, I love it. My Starbucks lids that I save all the time, and my little notes. Some extra harnesses that came with extra parts. And that concludes my updated toolbox tour for my Husky Top, my 68 Epic, and my Mac cart. Thank you guys.